Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. This is day 166 of my coding journey. So yeah, just gonna go over a few things I plan on doing today and a few things I did last night on a full stack e-commerce site. So I plan on signing up for a website called Leak Code. Uh, one of my friends told me about it. He said it helps you prepare for technical interviews. Uh, if you guys don't know, I do plan on searching for my first developer job here in a few months. So I need to start preparing now. And I'm really hopeful that I get that first position. Um, I know it's really hard nowadays to get a job uh, in this field. So really hoping that I just land that first position. But yeah, here's the site right here. I just uh, opened it up, so I don't know much about it, like I said. But uh, let's see how much it costs. Hopefully they got like a free version or something. But So it's $35 a month. Okay. Um... I did cancel my Team Treehouse and my Code Academy the other day. I did most of the stuff on there, so there was no point in me keeping those memberships. So, um, I mean, I could just sign up for this and just replace uh, one of those that I just canceled. So, but I'm going to look more into this today and hopefully start some challenges. I think it's challenges. I don't think it's like courses. I think it's like challenges you do, which is the cool thing. So, um, definitely going to really look into this today. And as for the full stack e-commerce site, it's loading right now. Let's get rid of that. Uh, so I did a little bit of work on this last night. So let's go ahead and add a pro add our test product to the cart. And um, as you can see, we get that confirmation. And if we add it again to the cart, we get a red one saying it's already in your cart. So you can't add it again. So um, <clears throat> here's what I added last night. So you click checkout and we got a nice little cool Letty animation right before our checkout form is loaded up. And now let's go ahead and check out. 4 And then we're gonna go ahead and process our order. And then we get another Lottie animation that says our order confirmed. A little, little cool animation there. I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger actually. You can't really see it. And then we get this little link. It says view your order and what the, where this take you is your wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Come on. Come on. Come on computer. The fan is blowing on my computer. I need a new computer. <laughs> come on. It takes you to the user dashboard. And as you can see, this stayed open. I'm going to try to fix that today. That's a it's just so much stuff just pops up when I'm working on other things, but this is another thing I gotta fix whenever I go to another page, the cart stays open. So, um, but yeah, here's our dashboard with all the orders that I did, test orders and stuff. So um, I'm actually gonna clear all this out. And yeah, so I did that last night. And if I got time, I do wanna do this leak code today, but after this, I'd, um, I might work on this project a little bit. Uh, let's see if I still got the image. Uh, so here's the little wireframe that I drew up at work. Of how I want the site to look. Let's go to home. Oh, click on that logo. That stayed open too. All right, so our hero section is already completed. So under here, I just want some icons. I want like four icons with like some text. And um, I think that'll look nice. So right underneath the hero section. And then I want daily deals and then four products. And I do want like a little tab thingy to where if you click on it, it takes you to like another section. I don't know how to uh, explain it. So I have new arrivals. I have four products for that. Then when you click on best sellers, it'll show four products for that all in the same um, the same line. So hopefully that'll look nice. And then I want a banner. And then down here will be shop men's. It'll have eight products. And then shop woman. And it'll be another eight products. And then uh, if, I don't know if you guys can see it, but over here is like a little, it says our blog question mark. So I might add a blog to it right underneath the woman section right before the footer. And then, uh, yeah, so after that, it'll be the footer and this site will be complete. I uh, still added more logic and stuff on the back end. Uh, that's why it just doesn't look like I'm really getting much work done on it. But trust me, I am. It's it's a lot to do on the back end part because um, it's like every time I fix something, 
another thing pops up as you guys can see i literally just went to the dashboard and saw that the menu was open so i gotta figure out how to close all these menus whenever the uh, um whenever i go to a navigate to another page so i'm gonna try to do that today as well but yeah that's really it for me today really about to sign up for this leak code and start some of these challenges gotta start preparing for these interviews and i will see you guys tomorrow peace